Hello again. Welcome to a much cooler, windier, more wintry day. I've even got long trousers on today. First time so far. I nearly wore a coat as well. So why am I filming this house? Well, it's for sale. Just an interesting thing came up on my Facebook feed. Of course, just shy of a million pounds. Here we go. And if you want to buy it, or just have a nose around and see what's there, have a look inside. The link to the sale description is uh, below in the description. Heading down, a couple of specials, I think. And uh, this is what I'm planning to see, put it up on the screen. There we go, Mayflower, that's the details. And people ask me, where do I get my details from? How do I know these trains are coming? And um, I use a few different things, but this one recently I've been using most from Andy sent me it from Dawlish. That's the one you've just seen. It gives you uh, information like that, nice and straightforward. Also gives you two links to real time train so you can check on the, the time it's gonna come through. And the uh, URL for that should be on the screen now. So uh, there we go, smashing. That's what I use. Winter fleece on today as well. Not ideal, but there we go. Got a nice little AI of a steam train as well, which we'll get to shortly. Quite pleased with that one. A couple of variations on it. Anyway, that'll be a little separate segment when we get to it. So I'll show you that in a bit. Of course, rude, not to do, just a spot of observation before I set off along the seawall. So we should do that now. Big thank you to everyone that wished me congratulations for my 2,000 subscriber milestone in the comments yesterday. Wonderful to see, wonderful to have. Say, so, I'm in uncharted territory now. I really never thought I'd have quite so many people interested in my daily walks. So uh, we're totally winging it now, just like I do in the videos. Anyway, I'll keep going. And here we go. The sea wall. Where we're going now, probably all the way along, and hopefully feed Rufus too. Smash in. Unfortunately, at least earlier on, the wind blocker was needed, but I'll make a decision when I get on the wall properly whether I need to keep it on or not. But rest assured, when the specials come through, wind or no wind, I'll take it off. If I remember. <laughs> Lovely. Let's get on to this steam train. Right, not a million miles from here, actually. So uh, I cut into the pre-prepared segment. See what you think. Oh, we'll do it as soon as this train's gone. Oh look, it's another special. Smash in. There we go, didn't know that one was coming through. Well, I kind of did, but I didn't know when. But back to here again, along there, steam train, smash in. Here we go, lovely steam train there, caught in time. No date, I'm afraid. As usual, put it into AI. I said, do something very, very realistic. Came up with this. That's not too bad, not too bad. Let's have it again, slow motion. Sorry about no sound effects. Yeah, it's not a million miles off, is it? Not right, but it's not terrible either. So anyway, as usual, back to frozen in time. There we go, but I thought I'd also show you one that it did that wasn't quite so realistic. This one here, there we are. Bit more crazy this, people sort of stood up, open top and everything. Bit mad, again, slow motion. There we are. And uh, this was Andy's favourite, Andy from Dawlish. He liked this one. He said it reminded him of a couple of trains in real life. Oh, blimey help. <laughs> but he said, no, no, he's serious. He said, show me a couple of pictures. He says, this is the Garrett that runs in Wales, although it's a different 
gauge it does it's classed as a british train and this one here used to run in east africa smashing anyway back to the walk i hope you enjoyed that quite weird quite weird and wonderful a couple of variations excellent lots of photographers down here on the wall today for the one that's coming along later it's not for about an hour though just have to find some things to do to kill the time can't spend an hour feeding roofers can i Zoom stuck then. Probably just cleaned the screen earlier. Oh well, I hope that doesn't happen when the uh, special comes through. Do we get toot? Do we get toot? Do we get toot? <laughs> yes! And I've got a wasp around my head, so I've got to cut this one short. <laughs> Sorry. I was holding that as steady as I could, and I've got this wasp buzzing right around my head, by my ear, really, really loud, so I had to cut that short. Anyway, let's feed Rufus. Uh, Rufus. Rufus, T. Robin, smashing. Well, there's a chap I met under the bushes. Just fed him in there and that's full. So we'll leave it for today. Let him enjoy the food he's got. Well, it was a nice chap I should be talking to, fed the Robin earlier. He also knows about the rats and is telling me about them. And I said, yes. So uh, just a little bit on the feeder from now on. No more on the floor. I'm going to take my chances now, wind blocker off, a little bit more natural sound, and why not? No, that didn't last long, I got as far as here, then he's blown away, so it's back on again. Sorry about that. Yes, the gantry has been painted, as Barry from back of Witherspoon said. See the other side as well. Yes, last time I filmed that, that was completely black. I probably wouldn't have spotted it myself, so thanks Barry. There's a semi-active water trickle there by the rain that we've had recently and I heard a toot and spray point. Happy train! Whee! And that's our blue and green one. Smashing! Crossover! Look at that! Who knew that was coming, eh? I didn't. The train gods are smiling on me today. Lovely. Want to go slow? Lovely. Full force wind in my face again. It'd be nice walking back down. So I'd be behind me. Here we go. Lovely. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Mayflower smashing. And of 
and course, as usual, I'll do my very best to catch that coming back. Lovely. That was good. Slightly earlier than expected, but I was in the right place with Roger. He's changed the name of his channel, so I'm not going to give you a top of my head. But what I will do is I'll put it up down the bottom of the screen. As usual, just walk along to the end of the wall, just to complete my walk, so to speak. <laughs> Have a look over at the Salty Dog. No doubt doing well today. I'll be tempted normally to do it if it wasn't Friday, but I've got pizza and wedges tonight. So looking forward to that instead. Don't want to go overboard. No. And there we go, Salty Dog. Open for business. Lovely. I think that car might be turning around, yep, that's right. Smash in. Oh, I say, if that tunnel could talk, tell you some stories of the trains it's seen, wouldn't that be fantastic? Lovely. I don't think I'll ever tire of Timoth. Don't think I ever will. In fact, if I get to the point where I'm no longer mobile and I can't do the walks anymore, I'll probably get myself one of these scooters, buggies, and roll along in one of those filming. And why not? Why not indeed? Quite a few people with drones today. Smaller ones than mine and bigger ones than mine as well. The chap I was talking to when I'm out with Rogers just now, I'm going to speak to him again. He's a flying a Mavic, I think, which is like a, quite a step up from mine. Bye bye. Will we get a two to spray point? Will we get a two to spray point? Nope. Too big to toot. Too big to toot, what a shame. Bye bye. Happy train. Lovely. That's our last train today. I think we've had one or two, haven't we? Smash in. And there we go, there's Roger. His channel underneath. Had a lovely chat. Probably won't see him to next year. But never mind. All good. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I certainly did. What a lovely day today. On the colder side, yes, but lovely weather. If it's like this again tomorrow, which is supposed to be, hopefully I'll do my video I've got planned, I've been working on, provisionally titled Lords of the Manor. But it'll all make sense when it goes live. If it's not tomorrow, it'll be soon. And uh, all good. So thanks for joining me. Smash in. Take care. Bye. <laughs>